Have you ever wondered about the enigmatic doctrine of the Trinity that often stirs controversy in religious discussions? The Trinity, a core belief in Christianity, is a concept that is often misunderstood and even disputed. It's not about worshipping three gods, but one God in three persons, God the Father, God the Son and God the Holy Spirit. They are distinct yet coexisting, each person of the Trinity is equally God, and there is only one God. The doctrine of Trinity is deeply rooted in the Christian faith. It is the belief that God has revealed himself in three different identities, yet remains one essence. God's own creation subtly mirrors this Trinitarian concept. Consider creation itself. It consists of space, matter, and time. Yet these three elements are not separate entities, but they exist as one unified creation. Delve into the concept of space. It consists of length, breadth, and height. Yet these three dimensions are not independent. They coalesce to form a singular concept of space. Consider the nature of matter, which comprises energy, motion, and phenomenon. Although these are distinct properties, they are not separate. They coexist and are inseparable, forming the one substance we know as matter. Reflect on the essence of time, which encompasses the past, present and future. These three aspects of time, while distinct, are not separate. They are interconnected and form the continuum of time as we understand it. Let's not forget about us humans. We are composed of body, soul and spirit. Yet we are not three separate entities but one individual being. The concept of Trinity is not as complicated or as contradictory as it may seem at first glance. It's a matter of understanding that just as these elements of creation are distinct yet unified, so is the nature of God in the Christian faith. To summarize, the doctrine of Trinity is the belief in one God who exists in three persons, God the Father, God the Son, and God the Holy Spirit. This belief is subtly reflected in aspects of creation and human nature. It's not about worshipping three separate gods, but understanding and acknowledging the triune nature of one God. If this explanation has shed some light on the doctrine of Trinity for you, please show your support by liking, commenting and sharing this video. And don't forget to subscribe for more insightful discussions. May God bless you on your journey of faith and understanding.